on these persons here present. To witness that I, Matthew James Collis, do take thee, Victoria Louise Westwood, to be my lawful wedded wife, to live together and love and harmony, to cherish and care for you, whatever the future may bring. I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, Victoria Louise Westwood, do take thee, Matthew James Collis, to be my lawful wedded husband, to live together in love and harmony, to cherish and care for you, whatever the future may bring. Let us hope this day will form a milestone in your lives to look back on with much love and happiness and we hope the feelings that you have for each other today will grow deeper and stronger every day. And it is with great pleasure that I can announce you are now husband and wife. Congratulations. I'm so immeasurably proud of you. And I know that I speak for all of us when I say that we're all of us proud to have been able to play our part in bringing you to where you are today and to the person that you are today because you look amazing and you are amazing. Matt is the kind of young man who I am very confident will look after Vicky exactly as Vicky needs. Because as those of you that spend time in their company will vouch, when you're with them, what you hear and what you see, and what you feel in their company, well, it's just right. You can see the love. So the best advice that I can give to both of you today is remember that. Nurture it, treasure it, treasure each other. Because if you do that, it doesn't matter what life throws at you. It's difficulties, it's good times, it's great times. You will always, always triumph. I wish you every happiness. God bless you. I wouldn't be a good best man if I didn't get a little soppy myself. Matt has genuinely been the most honest, loyal, reliable friend. And I've, I've genuinely put myself into some situations that I've needed some help with, that Matt has definitely got me out of. And I will always, always be genuinely grateful for that. And for this reason, I know Matt will make an amazing husband and Vic will want for nothing. beautiful wife for agreeing to marry me uh, and making me the happiest man in the world today. I think you'll agree that you, you know, she looked absolutely gorgeous today and when you walked down the aisle you did take my breath away which as an asthmatic you know is dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't meet each other you know, at a time where we were expecting to meet each other. I didn't go all the way to Australia to meet somebody who went to the same school as me. <laughs> but there was something about the first time we met and the first time we made eye contact after Sam said something pretty gross I think in that hostel in Melbourne. Um, it, it was nasty. <laughs> it was nasty. It's always stuck with me and I'll, I'll never forget that feeling. It was a very brave way to start a relationship I think to be fair but I think it made us very strong from the off. I think standing here today we can probably say it's paid off. I wouldn't change a thing about you. You always find a way to make me smile. You put up with my god-awful jokes, my love of football, my love of Formula One. You and Patsy complete me and we make up a wonderful little family. <laughs> <laughs>